Hi, my name is Amanda D'Antone and I'm a junior here at the Gabelli School of Business. I'm the Vice President of the Gabelli School of Business as well as the Chair of our Dean's Council. So my typical day consists of classes and meetings and my busiest days of the week tend to be Thursdays. So on Thursdays, I'll usually wake up around 7, 7.30 and have a cup of coffee because I can't do anything unless I'm extremely caffeinated in life. Usually in the morning I have classes. Um, sometime, you know, 8.30, 10 o'clock is when I'll start my day with classes and I'll go there until like about 1 to 2 and then I'll have a chance to prep for our Dean's Council meetings. Our Dean's Council meetings meet every Thursday from 1 to 2.15 so I get a chance to kind of sit after class, prep the meeting with my co-chair and get to meet with all of the Dean's Council members to learn about the subcommittees, how they're doing. After that I have USG meetings at 5.30. Um, which gets a chance to talk to the rest of the student government, inform them how we are operating, you know, great things going on in the business school. Then after that, I usually have squash practice at night, and then I finally get to come home and go to bed. So being a junior, most of my classes now are in Hughes Hall, which is our business building here at Fordham. Besides having awesome classrooms, it's also where our dean's offices are, so if I'm not in class, I'll usually be on the fourth floor um, talking to the deans about changes in curriculum or planning my schedule, registration, helping out with the freshmen. Um, there also is a 24-hour stock ticker on the first floor, so sometimes I'll be playing around on the Bloomberg terminals, researching for the research team for SWS, um, getting Bloomberg certified, things like that. There's also televisions that project events going on around campus, what's new for the week, and things like that. Usually if I'm looking for a place to study that is in the library, I'll snag one of the study rooms that are on all the floors in Hughes because they tend to be a nice, quiet place to relax with like a beautiful scene of campus and Keating and Eddie's. I'm currently majoring in Applied Accounting and Finance. When it came to choosing my major, I was super confused as to whether I wanted to go down the finance route or the accounting route, so knowing that Fordham had a major that combined the both was awesome and gave me a chance to kind of figure out whether I wanted to pursue that finance track or the accounting track. When I first took financial accounting, I absolutely fell in love with it. It was one of my favorite classes here, which kind of opened my eyes to potentially wanting to pursue the CPA track and really settle my heart on accounting, but it's been great because I get to take financial, intermediate financial accounting and managerial accounting classes like that that combine my love for accounting with classes like investments and security analysis, which analyze that financial sector and kind of bring together the whole realm of business, not only just the day-to-day -day financial aspect of it, but that overall broad accounting that all businesses must follow. So I think that the Applied Accounting and Finance major has been great because it gives me a chance to kind of pursue an accounting track but have that background in finance to really know fully how a business operates. So one of the most rewarding things I've been able to join here in Fordham is the Dean's Council. I got to join my freshman year and kind of learn the inner workings of really being that group of liaisons between the student body and the deans here at Fordham. We like to work as students to represent the voice of our other fellow students and make changes to the business school that promote our growth and where we want to see the school grow. So in order to do that from working as just, you know, a member to running my own subcommittee to now being the chair, I've gotten a chance to really get to know each one of my deans. We get to meet with them now on a pretty weekly basis and kind of go over our plans and how they correlate with their plans for the school and you know really get to make those changes and the whole council gets to meet with the deans once a month for super meetings where we get to propose the ideas that we've been working on for the month, get their feedback and really implement those changes and we've seen so many changes in course curriculums and new programs that were added specifically because of the initiatives that we've put through in Deans Council which has been an amazingly rewarding experience. One of the things that really attracted me to Gabelli School of Business was how caring and kind the people are here. It's all about building each other up and kind of not only seeing yourself succeed, but seeing everyone around you succeed. And I think it's been great to kind of have support from my fellow classmates, from you know my club advisors, and from the deans here at Fordham. And it's kind of been a great experience to not only learn and be so close to New York City, but to have people who really care about you and care about your success. The one piece of advice that I've given to my freshmen in academic advising that I would give to all freshmen is always to get involved in something that you love. You know, it's really easy to kind of get overwhelmed with all of the clubs and organizations that happen at college, but it's all about finding the things that make you happy in life. And if you pursue things that make you happy, 
you're just going to be happy throughout your entire career path and that's kind of a really good place to start is not doing what you think you should be doing but doing what you want to do and getting involved in those clubs and that, those organizations that make your heart warm and that make you really want to get involved and be the best that you can be. I'm Amanda Danton, tour guide, academic advisor, dean's council chair, and vice president of the Valley School of Business and thank you for watching Business as Usual.